Welcome to Divine Beings of the Cosmos. I hope you're taking care of yourself. I hope you're out in nature getting sun, drinking water. It's very crucial during this time of growth, expansion. Some would even say ascension. Ashe, I want to start by setting my intentions. I intend to be my highest self at all costs. My DNA is restored, activated, transformed, transfigured, embodying my soul essence. I will my will to the oneness of the divine. Ashe, I say this every once in a while and I feel like it's crucial. We don't just set intentions to set intentions. These are literal portals. These words carry portals with my vibrancy, with my vibe. And if you're receptive, it could take you on a very beautiful journey, a magical journey, Ashe. I'm being extra, but let's tap on in. Let's get it. I know you see my shirt. You thought this was a game. You thought this was a game. No, I'm just kidding. Much love, Galactic Federation. This is a galactic message. My beloved star seeds, my soul fam, the day of retribution, the day of reckoning, and the day of recognition, and the day of reciprocation are upon us. These are the days when the truth is unveiled and the balance is restored. I know on this journey you may have encountered individuals who harbored alternative motives and engaging with you only for their own gain without offering anything in return. These are the ones who sought to use your energy and your light, thinking they could manipulate you and exploit you. Yes, some may have even falsely accused you of practicing dark arts or worshipping evil forces. They're projecting their own misunderstanding and fears onto you. What fools! Mistaking your strength and integrity for something malevolent. But you are not a follower of darkness. You are a beacon of light. In truth, the very actions and intentions of these individuals reveal their own darkness. Their own attempts to harm you or wish ill upon you exposes their own true nature. They harbor a baseless hatred, unable to stand in your joy and high spirits. Their discomfort arises from their unable to control you to bring you down, to alter your perception of reality, to match their own family. Okay, these individuals are threatened by your resilience, by your unwavering positivity, and by your refusal to be distracted or diminish. They struggle with your steadfast commitment to your path and your practice, for it highlights their own insecurities and their own failures. Yes, I'm going in. On these days of cosmic reckoning, it becomes clear who stands in truth and who falters in deceit. Your power lies in your ability to remain steadfast, to rise above the negativity and continue shining your beautiful light. Those to seek to dim your light or distort your reality will find themselves exposed in their own true intentions and laid bare. Embrace this time of retribution and recognition. Let it be a reminder that your journey is one of ascension and purity. Continue to practice your truth, to stand firm in your light, and to repel any force that seeks to undermine your divine purpose. Ashe, as in unity and strength, this is a galactic collective message. As always, we are taking off. The Metal Alchemist, thank you for joining me on this magical adventure.